doing a ColourPop haul. Super excited. This is absolutely not sponsored. I bought all of these with uh, my own money. Uh, my, my, my own money. <laughs> if you guys want to see a makeup tutorial on the look that I have here, I did that in yesterday's video. You can click right here or down below. It's a chit chat. Get ready with me so you guys can like follow along, see exactly how I did everything. I've been seeing ColourPop everywhere and I'm so excited. I literally went on their website and I'm like, I want that one. I want that one. I want that one. I went crazy. I bought 22 different lip colors do not need. They are liquid lipsticks. They have satins and they also have mattes. I got a mix of both of them. So excited. If you don't want to bother with a lipstick or a gloss, it's kind of both in one. You just kind of swipe the color on and then you've got an awesome color. From what I've seen, from the few that I've tried, they have great color payoff. They glide on. They don't have a disgusting smell. You don't need to layer, layer, layer them on like one swipe and you have a full color on your lips. So this is an A plus already. I am so excited and the fact that they they retail for six dollars each. I'm not being paid or sponsored. They don't know. ColourPop doesn't even know that I exist. So I'm going to Instagram them and be like, hey ColourPop, I'm me. So maybe, you know, they'll see it. <laughs> Here is the box that they come in. Like I was dying. Look at that. That's so cute. So I wanted to kind of mimic those colors today. So I'm wearing like pink and champagne -y colors. Okay, so let me do all of the satin ones first. Then I'll move on to all the matte shades that I got. So the first one here is called Little Stitious. I like how the names were on them and on the products themselves. It says every name right on the bottom. Whenever I spell color or flavor with a U in it, people are like, oh, you spelled it wrong or favorite. Um, no, that's like the Canadian way is to add like a U. I don't know. So C-O-L-O-R is more like the American way. C-O-L-O-U-R is like Canadian British way. So just saying with that, because I know people are like, oh, you spelled color wrong. Like, no, it depends where you live. Like it all depends where you live. I spell color as C-O-L-O-R just because that's how I've always spelled it. But anyway, and this one here is beautiful. I got so many nudes, but I also got other colors too. So if you guys are like, why'd you buy so many nudes? I bought lots of lots of mattes and satin ones. This one is just honestly the perfect nude. This little stitious one. This one's like my favorite one probably. I haven't tried it on yet, but just in the packaging, the little stitious is like my fave one. Okay, this one is in botanical and I love everything peach right now. As do a lot of you guys like peach is so in and I love peach like peach 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 yes perfect for the spring and summer and I like the name botanical I just thought it was pretty and just to show you guys the brushes they all come with like a sponge tip applicator so you don't have the brush that can like feather they don't have like a nice scent but it's not gross either it's kind of just there and this one's pretty bright the next satin one that we have is called echo Park and it looks like this. This is the one that I'm wearing today on my lips. It's a beautiful kind of dark rosy nude. Love this color. One of my top threes that I was so excited for is Magic Wand. So beautiful this nude. So I'm gonna put Little Stitches in this one together because they are very, very similar. This one is uh, Little Stitches is more pinky. This one's more of like a kind of true nude color. Oh my God. It is a magic wand. This one's gonna be my magic wand. Only two satins left. This one here is Mess Around. It's like a deep, deep brown color. Well, not like deep, deep. It's just the brown color and it's beautiful. This one, oh my gosh. I cannot wait to wear this. This is more like a fall color, but you guys know me. I really don't care if it's fall, winter, spring, summer. I don't care. Like whatever color I'm feeling, that's what I wear. And that's what you guys should be too. Even though we yeah, got like peaches in right now and I'll wear some peach, but I'm not just gonna wear peach because it's in season. You know, I'm probably gonna to wear it in the fall too. This one is in Molly, Molly, and it looks like this. It's like a purpley. I love lipsticks like this. This is like, whenever I see a lipstick like this, I buy it right away like this. Kind of like, I don't even know how to explain this color. It's freaking beautiful like this. <sighs> love this. This is so stunning. I cannot wait to wear this. I don't know what they look like on the lips because I'm doing all the swatches after. So hopefully when you guys are seeing them, they're nice. And I'm not like, oh my God, look at this. And it's like gross on the lips. I have no idea. <laughs> so those were the satins. Now we will move on to the mattes that I got. 
tons of matte lips. Like really, did I really, did you really need this many? This trap one is like a toffee colored nudie. Um, like I said, I got a lot of nudie ones, but that's what I wear the most. So that's what I got the most, but I did go out of my comfort zone a little bit with a few of them. So yeah, so you know, I didn't just get that. Platform, platform, platform is another nudie color. It's just a little bit lighter, but they're, these ones are they basically the exact same, just lighter and darker. Magic one, but this one's satin, this one's matte. So I was like, I want the same, but not. <laughs> this one is in Koala. Look at that, look, look at that color compared to, let's compare it to Molly. It's so bright, it's so fun, it's a great, great color. I hope this looks good on me. I'm scared to pair this. I'm scared because I don't want it to be like weird looking on me, but I think I'll just stick to like a neutral eye so this can just do the justice of the lips for us. Oh my god. This is like a purple version of Saint Germain, I feel by MAC. Next we have First Base. And First Base looks like this. It's like a pinky, no, I was gonna say close to my color. No, it's not. It's more of a like dusty rose pink. I think these are very wearable and look so good on every skin tone for me personally. I mean, some people might say no, but I say yes. I love dusty roses. So this one, I didn't know that Karushe, is that how you say her name? Um, collabed with ColourPop, I had no idea. I just loved the color and this is her shade. I love this color in Chi. Oh my God, oh my God, yes, girl. And hers are different because here it's like, um, like a rosy gold and all the rest of them have just silver. You can see that there. You got this and then she rolled a little something on here. That wasn't just for me, I think this is just printed on here. So if you love Karushe, then, you know, this is her shade. And I bought it because it's like beautiful. It looks like butterscotch. Like, oh, and this one's like leaky a bit. <gasps> oh my God, oh my God, it's leaky. Probably because it's so hot here today. Next we have Seesaw. <gasps> Oh, oh, one of my favorite colors. I hope this looks good on me. Just to show you guys this one and first base next to each other, very, very different colors. I love pink, so I tried to grab a lot of them. This one is so pretty, like a dolly pink. Oh my God. I'm kind of obsessed. Like, is anyone else obsessed with makeup like me? Like, thumbs up if you are too. This one is the number one one that's out of my comfort zone, but I needed to venture out rather than just getting all nudes and pinks. So I got a red. Yes, I know. I am not a red lipstick wearer. I do not like red lips. I don't, I don't know why. I don't know why. I'm very much Hugh Hefner in that way. I always say that because the only other person I've heard say that is Hugh Hefner, how he doesn't really like red lips. Um, I'm the same way. I don't know. I just, I don't know. I don't know. Marilyn Monroe, Trisha Paytas, they pull off red lips so, so good. Like, oh my God, love them with red lips. But everyone else, I'm kind of just like, mm, you could have worn a nude. <laughs> Just kidding, where would you like, but it's just like a true nude. It's in Creeper and Creeper, like obviously I needed to get that. Like that's one of my most used words. So it's like a blood red, like I'm kind of scared of it, but you guys love when I have red lips on. I'm like trying to like get into it. So, you know, you know, it's good to like kind of change up your look and a simple little lipstick can. This one's in Bianca is another nude. How surprising, but this one is really pretty. I love this one. It's kind of like in between a darker and a lighter nude. So, you know, I just kind of bottle their nudes. Then we have Midi and Midi is another nude. <laughs> Yay. So that's what it looks like right here. Like I can what am I supposed to say about all these? Like this one's a light nude. This one's a dark nude. This one's a toffee nude. Like they're all nude. Zipper, zipper, zipper is pow. It's another comfort zone -y one. It's a purpley bang purpley, a dark purpley, but that pow purple. Oh my gosh, this is gonna make your teeth look super, super white. Let's put it into comparison with Koala. Like, so different. Molly, so pretty. I love these ColourPop. I hope that they last all day. From what I've heard, they do. This one here is in LAX. I don't know if it was LAX or LAX, cause I say LAX, bro, but LAX, like the airport. I'm not sure, but this one is really dark. The darkest one that I got. Beautiful brown, oh my God. It's kind of like almost like a, a reddy auburn or a purpley brown to me. Like it's almost like a deep burgundy. Oh my God, so pretty. Yeah, I like how they barely have any scent at all. Okay, next I got Clueless, 
when I got this one in hand, this was the only one that I'm like, ooh, I don't really know if I like that color. So hopefully the swatches here are doing it justice because when I had it, like when you're looking online, all their websites or all their swatches are so good. Like they're perfect online. But when I got it in hand, I'm like, ooh, this one, I don't think it'll look good on me, but you never know. Next we have Donut. Donut was the first one that I opened when I got my package because this one was like the number one, number one one that I was crazy excited for because it's such a unique color, like a peachy corally pink. Love it. I feel like it's really like springs up your makeup look. Three left. I know, I bought the whole freaking website. This one is shimmy, 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 shimmy. This one's like a pinky nude, very similar to my shirt here. Love that one. I'm pretty sure Cheap Thrills right here is another nude one. And then the other one is a, oh, whoa. No, this is like a purpley. Oh, it's like a mauve brew. Oh, I should have wore this today. <gasps> oh my God, this one's so pretty. Oh, this one's so pretty. This reminds me of Kylie right off the hop. And then the last one is the most pal one and it's in highball. Highball. Bye, Bob. Look at that super bright neon fuchsia color almost. Like, look. Eesh. It's like a Barbie lipstick, like Barbie's shoes, like on the actual Barbies, how they have those like pink shoes, like isn't this that exact color of them? So bright, yum, yes. So here are all the color pops that I got. I like need help. I don't know why, I just see it and if I'm really wanting it and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna do it, I buy them all. Like I just buy them all. I got every color now, I never need to buy lipsticks. Thank you for watching my channel. Like never need to buy them again. Oh my God, like who does this? It's gonna take like a whole drawer in my makeup collection. Co collection. So I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Thumbs up if you did and thumbs up for all my hard work and doing all those swatches cause I bet this is gonna take me a long time but it's so worth it for you guys and I really appreciate you. Love you and talk to you guys all later. Mwah! Bye kitties.